Standing way too close, you might catch fumes, might catch fumes when I zoom, when I zoom. As I wake up by myself, or right past noon, right past noon, then I'm doomed. Hey guys, what's up? Um, it is currently Saturday, it's 12.55. About to uh, start the day. Got a little extra sleep this morning. Um, I've been getting up every morning early, so got a little extra sleep. Gonna go to... Uh, body shop and uh, get a lift in with, with this goon Rob. TJ is also down there and uh, Troy. So we'll be meeting up with them. And uh, yeah, so uh, see you guys in the weight room. Alright guys, just got to body shop. Um, I'll give you a little tour. So this is where all the cages are and this is where we do, where we do our bullpens and our throwing and stuff. Um, here is right there. This building right here is the like weight room. If you follow if you follow this road down there, this road over there, um, that'll take you to our classroom. And then we have like some outside cages, but we don't use those. And then the tennis courts for the tennis kids that come to P27. And then there's also a pool behind this building right here. Today the plan is I'm probably gonna just do some. I'm probably gonna do some throwing. It's a long toss day today, so um, I'm going to have to do my warm-ups. I'm going to throw, do some long toss, and then do some arm care, and then lift. So that's what we're going to be doing here. Rob, what are you doing today? You're just going to hit and lift? Rob's going to get get some hacks in and then hit a lift. Let's see what TJ and Troy are doing today. Things right now. Yankees-Mets canceled because of a positive COVID test on the Mets, so not what you like to see. Um, all right, I'm gonna get into the grind here. All right, guys, had to come outside because the music and it's copyright. And we've already had an issue with that with the first video. So uh, YouTube's really kind of pissing me off so far because uh, the first video had a copyright claim. Um, which I didn't even talk about yet because apparently the video is not able to view in Denmark. But uh, that's, I mean, that's not a really big deal, but I don't know why I had a copyright claim. Um, but uh, no, I'm actually super, super sore today. Um, I just rolled out and almost everything I did hurt, which is not good. Um, but now that I'm all rolled out, should be ready to go. I'm going to do some bands, my shoulder tube. Um, stretch out and then uh, do some long toss. So, uh, yeah. Hi Troy, yo, plug the TikTok. What's the TikTok? Troy twenty five, stud. All right, warm up done. Um, now I'm gonna toss with Troy here, um, and then get into the long toss. So yeah, um, pretty much about it. Ready, stud. Ready, stud. <laughs>
All right, guys, just finished the long toss. Uh, I'm gonna throw a flat ground. That was absolutely exhausting. It's 100 degrees in here, if you can't tell by my face. So, um, yeah, need some water. Let's get right into the flat ground. background um now i gotta do some arm care stuff then we're gonna lift um pretty good flat ground i was commanding pretty well i'm changing that uh my arm path so hopefully i'll be sitting like 93 94 by changing that i've been trying to work on it but i haven't really found any drills that actually worked my pitching coach down here told me to put some weighted balls in my gloves so that's what i've been doing that's why i had the, the baseballs in my glove while i was long tossing was um so I could get that extra weight so I could tug my glove hand or my glove side down. Um, and my long toss, I felt like I was really throwing the ball, um, which was good. Um, I probably worked up to about 380 feet. Um, so good, good long toss uh, session today. Really good flat ground and uh, a good lift here after. I'm gonna do some arm care now, so I'll probably record that for what I do for arm care. We have a whole list up there of exercises, but we might have to pick six. So we will get into the arm care. Like I said, good overall throwing day. When we get back to the apartment, I'll talk a little bit more about uh, some MLB stuff. My boy Rob caught really well today. Uh, the frames are looking good, considering he had a torn labrum, right? Oh wait, was it late? No, rotator cuff. Rob had a torn rotator cuff. I'm thinking of Cook right now, Ryan Cook. Shout out to Ryan Cook, the torn labrum. He's gonna do some arm care to go back to the apartment. Rob's doing his arm care right now. Troy's over there talking with some, with some boys. So yeah, gonna do the arm care. All right guys, before we do the arm care, we're gonna walk down to a uh, body shop and see if they're open today, because we're not sure. And, uh, Lifting upstairs is not as fun as lifting downstairs because there's less equipment. So me and Rob are gonna take a walk. TJ went back to the apartment to shower and go to sleep, you said? Yeah. TJ's going back to sleep after he slept for probably about 11 hours last night. So shout out to TJ for going to sleep because that's what he does best. Sleep um, and eat. Sleep and eat. And we cook and clean after him, me and this kid. So, uh, yeah, they're definitely not open. There you go. Because there's no lights on. It's probably more like 80 right now. There's no sun, which is really good today because the sun, when the sun's out down here, is freaking hot, I tell you. Oh, here, I'll show you guys the school or where our classroom is. Well, Rob checks the weight room. I don't know if you guys can see, but that building right there. Right there is it the school building. So that's where we go at 8 a.m. every morning. Here's the pool too. Yo, we could probably hop in the pool today, actually. I'll show you guys the pool. So this will be like a campus tour plus a workout day. The pool is Olympic pool, actually, I think. So look, here's the pool. Yeah, there's people at the pool, so. Also, our apartments are right back there. See this building right here. That is our apartment complex, but we're way farther down that way, past this building, behind the tennis courts back there. So like four buildings down. Rob's taking pictures of me, as always. Him and TJ just take pictures of me vlogging because they don't support the vlog. We'll get into the arm care, I'm back up here. I'm gonna do six arm care exercises, and then probably lift, and then head back to the apartment, get some food and just chill out, probably watch some YouTube.
some kettlebell stuff, med ball stuff, and maybe some dumbbell stuff, mobility stuff for sure. So yeah, we're gonna get right into the lift and head back to the hotel after. that lift it is hotter than heck in there it's ridiculous I am drenched in sweat I'm gonna go back to the apartment and shower after me and Rob have a light toss Rob wants to toss for a little bit so we're gonna do that but yeah it was hot god it's tough South Carolina weather and then you get this humidity in here which sucks see you guys back at the apartment when I'm done tossing and uh, we'll talk about some MLB stuff and some other stuff regarding the channel. So see you guys later. All right guys, got back to the apartment a little bit. Showered, now I'm gonna make some food. Then me and TJ are gonna go to the store. So yeah, that's pretty much the rest of the day. But I wanted to talk to you guys about the Mets-Yankees game being postponed due to a positive COVID test with the Mets. So that is gonna have a huge effect obviously, on the, the rest of the league. They have just released this statement. The Mets-Marlins game postponed following two positive tests for COVID-19 in the Mets organization. Tonight's game between the Mets and Marlins at Marlins Park, as well as tomorrow's scheduled contest between the Mets and Yankees at Citi Field, have been postponed out of an abundance of caution and to allow for additional testing and contact tracing to be conducted. When did you uh, first find out that the Mets had a case, and when were you told that tomorrow was postponed? No, right when I got back into the clubhouse, when I got done with the post-game presser, uh, I I heard the news, and then and then the postponement started to roll in. So, um, yeah, you know, one of the unfortunate uh, things about this season that unfortunately these things are possible, and um, you know, hopefully it's not something that that spreads and becomes too serious. Most of the games are going to have to be canceled now that the Mets have, depending on how many positive COVID tests they have in the next few days. If the number stays the same or if the number rises, is going to be a huge factor in how the rest of the Mets season is going to go. So who knows how that is going to turn out. Now the Yankees are going to have to take a few days off now from playing because the Mets have the Yankees are going to take a little bit of damage now and already they already have because every single player on their team is hurt basically so not good for the Yankees because in a 60 game season when half your starting lineup is hurt that's gonna negatively affect you obviously so Yankees are gonna have to turn this around starting pitching has not been great my bagel just popped up which is nice because I'm hungry but yeah that's that's pretty much the MLB let's talk to you guys about other videos that you want me to do. I am going to also do some videos um, where I answer your guys' questions on um, baseball related only. So I'm going to be doing that, which will be coming out soon, hopefully. So that's pretty much where the channel is going. And this is probably going to be the end of the vlog. So, like I said, like, comment, subscribe, click the bell, stay tuned for more vlogs. Shit just to live this here lifestyle. Ain't no sleep, foaming out of here at the bottom, looking up my lifestyle.